Got shot. That was crazy. I tried to record this video the other day, and of course, GoPro did what GoPro does best and doesn't work. Overheats, quits working. Also, the footage I did get, I had the microphone plugged in, had it plugged in, and like the first however many minutes of the recording didn't get any of the audio. And then everything else it got the audio for so sometimes it just works sometimes it just doesn't hopefully it's working right now as we get into the house i'm getting a new camera and i'm probably never using the gopro again but yeah trump getting shot was crazy now you know more word has come out about like who it was and all that stuff that uh crooks guy kid whatever he was like 20 years old look like the type of person who would absolutely do something like that yeah you could have seen that coming just from looking at the guy maybe not maybe not the president or the former president whatever but something along these lines it kind of looked like the type but it was so freaking cool seeing uh like after it happened and he gets back up and uh he just like you know puts his fist in the air the way that he did it was like all right that's freaking cool He's like, you can't take me down. I thought that was pretty sick. And uh, I was telling my father-in-law about it, like, when it happened, because I saw it on TikTok. Someone was, like, live, and I was just, like, scrolling through, and a live popped up, and I was, I was getting ready to scroll past. And the person in the live was like, why is everyone in the comments saying uh, that uh, Trump was just shot? And I went, that's probably not real, but I'll Google it anyway. And sure enough, it had happened, like, maybe... 10 minutes before that, I was like, whoa, he actually did. Holy crap. Really don't want to get caught behind this guy. Because I can take off a whole lot faster. And sometimes this light will turn green immediately. And I'm in a rush because we are late to go do our, uh, our, our walk through of the new house. My wife is ahead of me because she has a doctor's appointment afterwards. And I am behind because I am slow. All right, well, we just got done doing our walkthrough. That took so much longer than I thought it was going to take. I thought it was going to be relatively quick. You know, they still had like a few uh, drywall touch-ups. And that's pretty much it. Well, not even drywall touch-ups. Just like the paint touch-ups. Uh, there was like one nail pop, which is kind of expected on houses like this that are new. It's just fine. You know, they they cover that under like a, a, a warranty thing. So not too worried about nail pops. Even, you know, future nail pops, they come back and they fix. So it's not like a huge deal. It has a heck of a freaking birthday take them a while to get there to Today's my birthday, it, which is Monday, as long as it gets fixed at some point out of July. Care. Today is my birthday, so it's kind of cool going through you know, doing the initial walkthrough of the house on my birthday. That was pretty sick. There was some paperwork to sign while we did it too. And I kept like wanting to write down 7 because that was the year I was born. And I kept wanting to write that down instead of 24 because, you know, it's 2024. That was the only struggle I had today was remembering that it's 2024 and not 1991. But it's getting exciting. What was I talking about before? That was like two hours ago. I think I was talking about Trump getting shot. I was talking to my father-in-law about it because that that uh, that picture came out of uh, him with like the flag behind him with his fist in the air with blood running down his face. And I was like, brother, that's gonna be on t-shirts for sure. It took him like an hour scrolling through TikTok, like an hour, maybe less. And there were people who already had that picture on a t-shirt for sale. Took him like no time. I'll be honest, I think I think that just I think that essentially just won him the election right there. And I'm kind of an in-betweener. I don't I mean I care about who wins the election because like it's my country. So it's like I care about who wins the election, but at the same time, I'm in the middle. I'm 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 pretty in the middle. I've got I got some things that I believe that the right does not agree with, and I got some things that the left does not agree with. And it's, it's, it's pretty even, I think, for the most, well, yeah, it's mostly even. I, I would say I'm more right-leaning 
I'd say for the most part, I'm more right leaning. But yeah, that was freaking crazy. I, I, again, I don't know where I left off. I, I just drove for an hour on the interstate to get back home. And uh, I don't remember where I left off. Trump something, that's all I remember. Trump something, Trump shot, Trump down, Trump up, Trump fist up, Trump probably gonna win. Which is, which is great. I mean, let's be, let's be honest here, let's be honest. If you've gotta pick between the two evils, which one would you prefer? If anyone says Biden, they're out of their minds. This guy's, the, 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 because that guy's out of his mind. He's clearly not the decision maker because uh, he can't make any, he can't make a sentence, much less a decision. I say RFK, I say vote, vote RFK. I like that dude. And he's jacked. I guess said something about, you know, your character, that you're willing to take care of yourself that much. And he's, I mean, yeah, he's still old. They're all old. Everyone who wants to run is old. I'm not a very political person though, so I don't really know what I'm talking about. But what I do know is in the last four years, things have got significantly more expensive and I don't like that. I don't think anybody should. If you do like that, then I don't like you because now I can't afford stuff. I can't afford stuff like I used to. Oh, we got a tractor. Got a tractor. I've always wanted to drive underneath one of those sprayers. It always looked like fun to me. I, I had the opportunity the other day, or I, I guess not the other day, but like, no, it was the other day. It was like two days ago. I had the opportunity to drive underneath of a sprayer, but I didn't take it because I was too scared. I don't want to get in trouble or get hurt. Anyway, that's all I got. It was kind of random rambling about nothing nonsense, so enjoy. Okay, love you. Bye-bye.